Hey guys, welcome back to today's video. It's your girl, Jungle Naps, AKA Jensen. So I was watching the Emmys yesterday and when I saw Taraji P. Henson walk down the red carpet in that bomb yellow dress and that beautiful hair and makeup, I was like, okay, you know what? I gotta recreate this look, like, so help me. <laughs> so, you know, I pulled myself together. I got this beautiful, you know, natural, glowy look that her makeup artist, Ashunti Sheriff, put together. So, you know, I tried my best to really duplicate it, but most of the products come from Taraji's collab with MAC. So if you already have those products, then awesome. You're gonna be able to do it like spot on. But I didn't really order it. So, you know, I'm just improvising with what I have here. The collection is sold out, so you can't even buy it anymore, which just makes me so sad. But um, yeah, you know what? If you guys are new here, don't forget to click the like button and go ahead and subscribe, you know? Anyway, if you're new, you should be subscribed because you don't want to miss all these awesome notifications. All right, so let's just get to beating this face. Let's do it. One of my favorite things about the look that Taraji had at the Emmys was that it was just so natural. And first of all, you know, it was all about glowy skin. She actually doesn't like a lot of heavy coverage makeup, according to her makeup artist. So I'm gonna go ahead and start with the Giorgio Armani Luminous Silk Foundation. Now this is not a cheap foundation, but it looks so beautiful and has such a wonderful natural finish on the skin. So because this foundation is so expensive and I don't wanna waste any, I'm gonna just use my foundation brush and then I'm gonna go in with my beauty blender to just kind of blend any spots that, you know, look a bit uneven or anything like that. So moving on, I'm gonna go ahead and take my Tarte Shape Tape Concealer I just started using this, you guys, and I'm so in love. Like, it doesn't crease. It is such an amazing concealer. So I'm just gonna go ahead and highlight down my nose, my forehead, chin, a little bit in my mustache area. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and blend that with my Faithful Beauty Blender. I feel like nothing just even comes close, you know, to get that airbrushed look. And oh my God, you guys, I am sweating up a storm. It's really hot in my apartment today. So I'm gonna be setting my makeup like nobody's business. All right, so I can already feel myself starting to sweat so much. So I'm gonna take my uh, Kat Von D setting powder here. I'm gonna dip, this is also the brush from them. And I'm just gonna sweep it all over my face. So now I'm gonna take the other side of my beauty blender, the clean side, and then I'm gonna dip that into the lid of my setting powder right here. And just make sure I press it nice and light. And I'm gonna go ahead and bake. Don't want any creasing going on today. So now that I look like a creepy ghost, <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and move on to the eyes while that's setting. So Taraji had a super simple eye look. She basically used her um, shimmer from her collection with MAC, and then she added like a coppery tone on top of that. I'm gonna go in with Gold Deposit. You can use any type of gold highlight that you have, and I'm just gonna use my fingers here and just lightly place that all over my lid. Gotta make sure it looks super seamless. And if you go ahead and look at her pictures from the red carpet, like it's just a hint of shimmer, so it's really subtle. 
Her makeup artist also used a coppery shadow on like the outside. So I'm just gonna grab my good old chesty naked palette. I mean, I feel like this is just something that a lot of you guys have already. <laughs> and I'm gonna use the color Smog and then I'm gonna concentrate it on the outer part of my eyelid. And also I have a really good tip for you guys. So if you have hooded eyes or downward shaped eyes, it's really important to go from when you're you know, adding eyeshadow to the outer part, to go from the top of your lid and go all the way out here. And I usually like to use a straight edge and then just shape it like that. So going up like this, so you really want to keep that nice straight line that's like slanted a little bit going upward. And what that does is it creates the illusion that the eye is just a little bit more open. You know what I mean? So that just looks super cute. And then I'm just going to go ahead and soften this out just a little bit because it looks a little bit too harsh on the edge. Okay, so now that we have just this beautiful like copper subtle shimmer going on in the eyes I'm gonna go ahead and dust off all this baking and then we're gonna get on and go ahead to contouring sweet so now we're ready to go ahead and add that contour and her makeup artist just did like a really really light contour it wasn't harsh at all and then she had a subtle glow for her highlight For Taraji's highlight, her makeup artist actually used the highlighter from her collection with MAC. I don't have that. I do have this MAC um, highlight. It's called Highly Illogical. Um, and I know it looks kind of bright here, but it is so nice and so subtle on the cheeks, which is what Taraji's highlight was. It wasn't really too noticeable in pictures, like it wasn't blinding you. It was more of like a soft, natural highlight. And for blush, I'm going in with this lovely one from Shea Moisture, it's called Spice. I've actually never really used any of theirs before, but I'm loving them. They're really highly pigmented, so watch out. On Taraji's lips, she actually just had a really soft, like, nutty nude kind of a color so let me see what i have in my collection and then um i'm gonna be back and share with you guys okay so i decided to go with a lip combo from urban decay i'm going in with their lip pencil conspiracy And like real quick let's just talk about their packaging like look at this it's a little bullet like isn't this so cute <laughs> all right so this is the final look I think uh, it looks very similar to what Taraji had and uh, I think she freaking rocked the Emmys, if you ask me. And I think that I rocked this look. So give me a thumbs up for this, you guys, if you're around till the end of the video. Woohoo! <laughs> Thanks for sticking around. And if you're new here, please subscribe. I hope you guys enjoy this video. I will be back again this week with another new video. So make sure that your notifications are turned on and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye!